and welcome to a new Plugin Guru video. My name is John Skippy Limpool. Welcome and happy 2020. It is January 5th and I'm about to release this plugin for everybody to play with. This is Unify and Unify is a kind of unique plugin in that it's a self-contained instrument. It comes with 400 patches that do anything from pianos to pads, to really cool plucks. This is using FM and two sample maps across the keyboard to all sorts of crazy things. If we go down here to the beep, well, let me show you rock guitars because these are so fun. For those about to rock. <laughs> Um, so by the way, check this out. If you turn off our noise box, which is our really cool custom, you can design your own distortion table and it's got pre-filtering and post-filtering that's resonant, multi-mode, up to 48 dB for low pass, high pass, band pass, band reject filters. Just insane. Um, if you bypass that and you bypass the convolution reverb, which is actually doing a, a distortion convolution preset, it's not doing reverb at the moment. It sounds like this. <laughs> so you turn back on noise box. And then you add on convolution from the clang falter. It's pretty insane. Go from that, you can use your own effects. So this is using, I started with the 12 string guitar. This is from Mega Magic Guitars Volume 1. It's six samples across the keyboard. And then I added Ample Guitars little, it's actually the free one that you can download from their website for free. And then on top of that, we have the D50 playing along. Combine all three of those and you get... This cool, amazing sound that requires all three of these sounds. Right? So that kind of power is just insane. To do that, you would need to own the D50 and you need to own the Ample Guitar and have them installed. Okay, just so we're, sh just so we're clear. Um, I can hold down Option and delete these. And this is the preset that was... You can find this preset. It's called, right here, Guitar 12 String Alvarez. Um, right? So that's how you can grow things so easily. My ear itches like you wouldn't believe. So I'm gonna scratch it real quick. Uh, but up here under BPM, we have all of these just, are you ready? I don't think you're ready, but we, it's Airwave. Uh, he loves to push things to the limit. He's We got real-time controls. <laughs> I mean, it's just like game over. It's so fun to play with these. Um, just the 
the, the mix of what you can do with this. Uh, Convolutions is using the clang falters for a really cool trick. So cool. Um, These sounds you're hearing that I've been showing, aside from the one that had the D50 and the Ample guitar, these are installed in Unify when you install it. You don't need to scan for any of your plugins, and these all work. The, the way that works is because right here we have a VST folder. We have the blue ARP, which is the ARP that's playing all the rhythmic stuff. Here's the FM synthesizer, phase distortion synthesizer, our convolution. These are different companies that we have communicated with and received their blessing to include in Unify. I thank them all dearly for letting us try this experiment. It's been, it's been really rewarding to see these synthesizers working together to make such really cool sounds and be so useful. For being free plugins, you can do some amazing things with them. They're right here. Here's a list of these plugins that you can choose from. Um, audio effects are found right here. There's insert effects right here. So you can go up here to the Unify Standard folder and we have our own delay. We have a really cool dis the distortion for the guitars is noise box. We have the enforcer for compressor. Pump house is like an LFO tool where you can go over here and you can click and you can make your own envelopes and do all sorts of crazy things. We have the ability to modulate this with knobs and stuff, and it's all just a straight pattern, so it can go from half to double to triple, all the kind of stuff, up to 16th notes. It goes on and on and on, the effects that we have in here. We've got uh, three different EQs. We've got uh, chorus, phaser, flanger, and then we have four different reverbs, plus convolution reverb, plus the MDA effects that go sprinkled throughout. So these are all included inside of Unify so that all of these patches, all these pianos, all the guitars, all these... You don't need anything but Unify installed to play these. And then you go over here to this page, you go scan, say sure, scan my VST folder. We have our own system in place where it can scan all of your plugins and you can keep playing with Unify because it's scanning in the background. So I can go to anything. I could go to the BPM stuff and call up something and play. And, and it's still scanning in the background. <laughs> and if it crashes, because usually plug-in scanners crash, um, it will reset itself to right here in the middle of the screen, but it doesn't crash Unify and it won't crash your DAW. We have a system in place where it's firewalled and protected from crashing anything else which is really cool. This is just doing a quick scan. I've already scanned on all of my plugins. Now this message here just says that all these things that say 32 are 32-bit plugins, which are no longer compatible on the Mac, but the VST folder includes them anyhow. So the power of Unify is that you have unlimited MIDI effects, unlimited instrument layers, unlimited on the insert effect chain for how many effects you want to use. Although I will say, uh, it's really easy for this list to get big that you can't read it. So we designed the interface so you can click and drag to make it wider. Uh, you can go like this and make it even wider still if you want. That There's auxiliary buses, like this is using three auxiliary buses. We have knobs that are able to do some pretty amazing things. We have it built in where it can talk to any parameter of the mixer, the auxiliary buses, or any effect whether it's your effects or the effects that are built into Unify, you can go to an instrument to something that's OBXD. Here's all the parameters for OBXD. If I said, no, I wanted this to be Serum right here instead of the Guru Sampler, I could go down here, go down the list to Serum. And you'll notice this is a different looking list. This is because we have our own, what we call subsets. And subsets let you organize your plugins the way you want them to be organized. So I could say by company, and here's Roland, Korg, Arturia, as ways to see things, or alphabetically with all my plugins. And I have a lot of plugins. So I can go over here, here's Serum. Because I did that, if I go back to this knob control, you can see the ones that were looking, they get turned into red, but I can say, okay, I don't need you anymore. Go here to instrument to the last thing that's you can at Serum. Here's all the parameters of Serum. 
So you could have six different Serum layers playing and one mod wheel changing parameters to all Serum plugins at the same time. It's, it's a level of power that's really, really addictive. It's really fun. This is subsets. And with subsets, you can go over to like to audio effects. And what I love is we were able to easily go here to our search page. This is all the effects that are currently installed in Unify. I could say delay and all the delays show up. I can select all them. I added them and I saved it. So when I go out here on the insert effect bus or an auxiliary bus, I can go here to the effect type subsets and here's all the delays that I have access to from all of the companies. So instead of seeing everything inside of the company folders where I can't remember what companies I bought delays from, you know, that type of thing. Now I can just go here and here's the delays from all the companies put together or all the reverb plugins put together. So I can just go, oh, I want to use this reverb or something like that. So much nicer to work this way than to work where it's just as you never use certain delays because you forgot you own them, right? So let me do this. Let me go to, I love to work with this. So this is, let me show you how easy this is. You go layer, add an empty layer. Let's go over here. Let's look down our list. I could go, mm, who do I want to play with? There's so many different synthesizers I could play with. Um, Icarus. I want to test it because I haven't got my key with me right now. Um, and I could go to, let's go to Bell and let's. That might be cool. So here's Icarus. Um, another thing to point out is that this works for each layer. Each instrument is on its own computer processor thread. So you can add and layer to your heart's content and it won't hurt in the same way as if it was just your normal plugin with one processor that everything has to work from. So. So it's so easy to all of a sudden have three layers making a really cool sound. Your plugins get new life, getting to play with all the other plugins that you've enjoyed. Your favorite plugins get to work together. It's, it's fun. We'll probably have a demo version of Unify out in February. We're just now getting this out the door. It's on sale until February 15th. After February 15th, we will not have Unify on sale ever again. It's not one of these things that I'm going to be offering at any sort of discount. It's going to be at its price. And that's what it is. So please go to the website. The price is there for it. And you will be shocked at what kind of a nice price it is. And in closing, I can't say much about this, but there's a new synthesizer in the works for Korg that will be introduced really soon, like in a day. And I worked on it last year and Korg licensed a whole bunch of samples from me for this new product. And those samples, most of those are in Unify as well. So it's really cool that there's two new products coming out with plugin guru samples in them at the same time. Good times. So that's a, a fast, brief, crazy journey of, I didn't, I'm not going to play through all the, somebody else will make a video where they play through every patch. I'm not going to do that. I just want to play the rock guitar somewhere. Here's Twang Rock. I love this. <laughs> So thank you again for your interest in Unify. I think it's going to bring something new to the community for everybody. I can make libraries in the future for more than one plugin. Um, there's all sorts of updates in the works for Unify to add new features, refine the features that you find in the interface. This is 1.0 of Unify. At the moment, we're not compatible with Catalina. There are some plugins that we don't work with. We've tried, we're working to get through to all of them. There's just so many plugins and then some of them work in different ways. Uh, we're learning the plugin universe is very much like the Wild West in some respects. But the majority of the plugins in my list of plugins that I showed you, most of these work and work really nicely. And it's fun to get them all playing together. So thank you. Enjoy. And we'll see you in the next. There's 
So there's five videos about to pop up after this that are the owner's manual in video form. There's video one is how to install Unify and license it. Video two is about getting your own plugins into Unify and working with subsets. Video three is a tour of the interface. Video four is a tour of the four layers, the MIDI effects and the instruments and the auxiliary buses and the master effects. So you understand all four layers. And then video five is talking about each of the plugins that are included with Unify. Those videos will show up after this video. So thank you for your support. Enjoy and we'll see you around.